Mark. You met the churn. Thank you. Yeah, the Mets are great. Dr. Bamberg erwartet me. You don't know me. The private party, son. He knows who I am. Young man, if you would care to call in at my office. Yeah, I've been trying to for weeks, but they wouldn't let me get here. That's why I came here tonight. You've got a line. Look. All I want to do is see her, okay? I mean, I've got a right to do that. No! All right, son. Take Don't come back, back off! Yeah, that's right. He doesn't want me hurt. Wouldn't want to spill any of that pure blood, would you, doctor? Now, come on, son. Why don't you just... Do you people know who you're sitting with? Do you care? Son, I want to talk with you. One American to another. <laughs> I'm not American, sir. I'm an Aryan. Ask him. If you would tell me, please, how I can help you. You know damn well how. You're gonna take me to see her. Now. Very well. Cracker, for God's sake, you can't go. No, it's quite all right. The young man needs help. I'm happy to try. My goodness. Look what a stir you have caused. These poor people, they are terrified. They came to drink some beer, and suddenly, you don't really need that. You know you don't. Stay right there, you filthy scum. You used me. I used you? Lebensborn. I found out everything. But you can't have her. She doesn't belong to you. She's mine. Hold it! <laughs> Look at that face. What about it? It's perfect. Look at those big blue eyes. Oh, forget the eyes, Jerry. Eyes are a dime a dozen. Look at the ears. They're enormous. Hey, all the research says big ears sell peanut butter. Aren't you reaching a little bit? Where the hell is Alicia? Oh, you're here already. I thought we said 10.30. We did say 10.30. Gordon, darling, am I losing my mind? No, we got here a little early, and Jerry thought we may as well get started. Oh, did he? Not by going through my pictures. Give me a break, fellas. You can't tell anything from these. And we have real live actors outside. Gordon, that is such a boring tie. You think that bad? Gordon has a problem, my love. Oh, yes, my dear. I'm well aware of that. Well, it's just that I can't see any of those guys being spokesmen for sunlight peanut butter. Well, of course you can't. These are file shots. Absolutely ancient. Excuse me. There's a guy here to see you from the State Department. The State Department? What's the problem? Oh, Central America, the Middle East. <laughs> Pull yourself together. <laughs> he evidently wouldn't say. Do you want him in here or there? No, I'll see him in there. Okay? Sorry, fellas. Just give me two minutes. And don't look at my pictures, huh? Mrs. Brownie? Hey, this is what I'm looking for, Jerry. Look at this face. It's fresh. It's real. And it's Mrs. Browning's son. Great. Let's get him in here. Mr. Dunn, Mark is in Germany at the moment, studying economics. Well, damn, he's so perfect. Alicia? What's 
What's wrong? What is it? What's the problem? I am Felix Neumann, old friend of Odysseus. Uh, Mark was my student at Yale. Oh, yes. Also in Germany. Yes, I remember. We met at her wedding. Uh, you are? I'm Joe, Alicia's sister. I see. Her half-sister, really. You came all the way from Germany? Oh, I can't tell you how much we appreciate that. Losing her husband first, and now Mark. Well, she needs all the support she can get. Such a waste. Such a tragic waste. Please make yourself comfortable, and I'll tell her that you're here. Thank you. Uh, unemployment, the, the threats of nuclear war. In Germany, these are issues which are taken seriously, especially by the young. Are you saying he was involved with radicals, terrorists? I don't know. He did not confide in me for some time now. Uh, did, he, did he write to you? No, not a word, not for months, but it wasn't that unusual. The last letter I got from him, he asked me to come to Germany. Of he said no. You have not been back since you were five years old. Could I go back? My father died in Dachau. Yes, so no. Something I've always been very proud of. Many Germans had the guts to oppose. Sorry, Felix. To oppose Hitler? It's <laughs> all right. In my family, we had a long tradition of military service. My, my brother and I were both in the service. Uh, we, we had no choice. Now you had a brother. Oh, yes. Died in the war. Man. I worshipped you. I should have gone. I could have stopped him. You must not think that, Evelyn. Now the country that took my father's taken my son. When they told me, when the when the when the man from the State Department, I, th I thought, you know, wrong kid. I couldn't do that. He just he just wouldn't. The, the police believe that he had been drinking they, rather heavily. They Sorry. Said. Sorry. Drinking or not, the boy I knew just wouldn't pick up a gun and try to shoot a NATO officer. It is these people who do precisely that. Not Think him. of Bader Meinhardt, the Red Brigade. Not him. Not Mark. God. If I only knew why. You should still not bring him back. Forgive me, deeply. You must. Learn to accept that, not torture yourself with questions which no one can answer. He was a little boy going through that stage when they ask a lot of questions. 